Hi, my name is Brenda McLaughlin. I'm a coach at Hatch Coding, and today I'd like to introduce you to our new user experience. This is what you'll see when you log into Hatch for the very first time and do your first project. This screen is called the Integrated Development Environment, or IDE. It's where you'll be coding all your projects. On the left, you can see an instruction panel. Type what you see is the simplest level of instructions. It shows the basic code that makes the project work. Above that is pseudocode. It describes the steps you need to code, but it doesn't give you the actual code. The English description level only tells you the main idea of the component. If you're not sure how to code at this level, you should move on to either of the two other levels below it. When you click the highlighted parts of the code, you'll see a pop-up explaining what that part of the code means and how it works. You can even click do more research to get even more information on that line of code. The white space in the middle is where you can type your code. Make sure to copy the code in type what you see and make sure it's exactly the way it looks on the left hand side. This includes brackets, semicolons, capitals, and lowercase letters. Otherwise, the IDE won't understand your code. As you code, you can check to see what you've made by looking at the canvas on the right. You can refresh the image by clicking the refresh button. If you want to see an example of what the finished product should look like, click the see example button on the top right. The feedback button is where you will find comments from your coach after you submit your project. And if you're stuck or have a question, click help to send a message to a coach. They will respond as soon as possible. You can read the responses by clicking on feedback. As you work on your project, it will save automatically, but you can also press save. When you're done your project and ready to submit it for a coach to mark, click the I'm done button. A pop-up will show up telling you how many points you've earned for this project. Next, you will move on to extending your project. Now it's your turn. Complete the first project and check back with me when it's all done.